Hey everyone, welcome back to the Java interview kit. Today we are diving into one of the most frequently asked backend interview questions. It is optimistic versus pessimistic locking. So we will explain it in a simple term using a banking example that you will never forget. So imagine a bank account. So let's say you and I both want to update the same bank account uh, balance at the same time. So this is where locking comes into play. So uh, pessimistic locking. So pessimistic pessimistic locking assumes conflict will happen. So it locks the record before any update. So imagine you walk into the bank and say like, uh, please lock my account. Nobody else can touch it until I'm done transferring my money. So in a SQL, SQL we'll there select that uh, row for update, like select star from that account where ID is equal to something, something for update. So what will happen is so now this account row will be locked. So no one else can read or write until I'm done with my transactions. So when to use this pessimistic locking? So when there is a high risk of conflict at that time, you should use this pessimistic locking or critical operations like transferring the money between accounts is involved. So it is very risky, right? So at that time we should use pessimistic locking. There is a downside that Others have to wait that uh, slows down the system when we use pessimistic locking. On the other side, optimistic locking. So optimistic locking assume conflicts are very rare. Imagine you quietly note the current balance and version number, do your calculation and then say update the balance, but only if nobody else changed it. So how it works? So the account has a version column. When you update, you check the version is still the same. So in SQL, it may look like update the accounts, set balance is equal to something where version and update the version is equal to version plus one, where ID is equal to one and version is a specific version, let's say five. So if someone else updated the balance, so the version will be different. It won't be the five. So and at that time, your update will fail automatically. So when we use optimistic locking, so there are heavy reads means many reads but fewer writes and example like just weaving account statement or balance inquiries at that time we use uh, optimistic locking so downside here is like you might have to retry again and again if you found this uh, useful like this video uh, drop your questions in the comment and subscribe to the java interview kit and for more clear explanation and of the real interview topics. And see you next time. Good morning and good